I'm sorry. Okay, I'm back to English. <laughs> so, some of you had a hard time, but with all you have, you put all your energy, and now you have become the star. You have become the star in such a wonderful, positive way. And Ace of Swords, you have um, stand up um, against all odds, and you have come out on top. You have the energy of the star. These two energy is when you have gone through hardship, okay? Because the five of pentacles, you've gone through hardship, but you still kept on going and going and you are coming out on top because the energy of the star you guys are the only one that has received the star then there is the energy of the four of pentacles you have a strong foundation whatever you are doing if you're starting your own business if you are in a conflict with people and that sort of a thing and you have been going through some hardship you have a strong foundation now you have gone you that lesson <laughs> now you have gone through that lesson oh my god the lovers come out mm, mm, mm. wow this is week of the lovers for a lot of signs and a celebration okay so the weekend for you guys the weekend for you guys is going to be fabulous weekend for you got oh my god and the two of pentacles some of you have to make it's a week of the um some decisions it's a week where you need to make some decisions and i'm going to just spring up more on the bed because we're doing this wonderful um the, it's a week i'm loving this week for you guys because it's as if some of you have been going through some um hardship and it can be um, conflicts inner conflicts that you're dealing with with yourself it can be inner conflicts it can be things that you have been going through but you stand your ground and you have protect yourself you have stand your ground you have protect yourself and um, through all the stuff that you have been going through you still toil through it you still push yourself you still gave yourself that push even sometimes you feel as if I have no more energies and you are going to become the star you are going to win this thing some of you are going to be a very very positive in whatever you do because you're going to win this thing what I'm seeing for some people is that um, with your intellectual communication um, what happened is that uh, it's as if the universe open up for you the energy of the star and the lovers people are going to be admiring you for what you have achieved and what you have accomplished so with the energy of the star and the lovers is that a great admiration admiration is going to be coming in for a lot of you out there because people are going to be admiring you um, for how far you have come on this journey uh, by just pushing forward and there in this weekend a lot of you are going to be connecting um, with the lovers okay a lot of you are going to be celebrating um in relationship a lot of you are going to be connecting in a relationship a lot of you are going to be meeting someone from a past life who can be a soulmate or a twin flame now the star is lining up you both because um the the, the situation with a star and the lovers is also the star um, is lining up or your universal angels both from um, your twin flame or soulmate uh, um, side and yours is actually lining up um, you both together to make this transition and this is going to be made in a very very positive way okay I'm gabbling on let's see what does the energy of um, the five of pentacles and the seven of pentacles what is it saying because some of you have to make a decision um, here 
good news is about to come out ladies and gentlemen thank you so whatever the hardship was whatever the moolik situation um, whether in your materialistic world whether in your physical world or your materialistic world there is going to be some positive news coming out so let's see um, what else is happening the nine of ones you need to protect yourself ladies and gentlemen you need to protect yourself because whenever um, we come through a period in our lives we need to protect yourself you're too open you need to protect yourself ladies and gentlemen in the middle of the week you're planting this is good because it's twice the seven of Pentacles so if you have a business if you're um, going to be doing a business or that sort of a thing it's going to be a positive what whatever you're um, whatever you have started this business is going to grow in a very positive and a powerful way let's see what is happening in the, the beginning of the week what 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 sort of energy is a strong foundation and this is good and I have some numbers for you guys um, you have twice so um, whatever is happening if you have been going through hardship uh, uh, with that sort of a situation without situation and that sort of a situation all of a sudden you're going to receive an offer about a new apartment a new house or something like that if you have been trying to sell your house this is going to be happening some of you are going to be deciding whether or not they should sell their house and find a new one yes you should um, you have a strong foundation you will find your dream house and you will find the right house that you're looking for what is happening with the seven of pentacles and the star what is happening with the seven of pentacles and the star um, news is going to be coming and this is positive news and this is what I was saying that a lot of people are going to be admiring you for what you have been doing a lot of people are going to be admiring you for what you have been doing okay there's a lot of admiration that is going to come in a lot of people are going to be um, you know thumbs up in you and showing you and saying you know thank you for um, your service or that sort of a thing or at work they're going to be um, good news coming in for you what is happening uh, with the star and the ace of sword a wonderful energy of the ten of Pentacles is coming in ten of Pentacles is always a good connection with the family is that you're working on whatever situation with a family and this is going to be good you're working out um, karmatic situation with a family money is going to come in. you're going to be connecting some of you are going to be um, connecting with a lover a past lover this person is going to be coming back in your life um, it could be a separation that you guys have separated and now this person is going to be coming back in your life which is wonderful the seven of swords keep on coming up I'm sorry it's just an energy in this week that has been always coming up and I can you see I'm shuffling the cards at the same time that I'm speaking so there could be a something that was stolen out of your house okay this is what I'm receiving um, be very aware of your house make sure that check your house when you come in in this week there could be things or people or i um, seeing this coming in that you have a strong foundation against something that was stolen out of your house okay there was something that has been stolen out of your house and um, you you have a strong foundation over this situation because it was um, it is it's as if yes you have an idea who did it when it happened and that sort of a thing and yes you are going to realize there is situation about houses some of you are going to be finding your dream house. some of you are going to um, you and your partner is going to be finding the perfect house and the perfect dream house there's going to be a celebration um, and it could be that some of you who are connected with a new love in your life um, in the weekend you're going to be moving to your home place and this is going to be good okay you two are going to be starting over you two are going to be setting grounds and it is going to be um, very positive let's see what the lovers and the three of cups what is the celebration is a celebration about a new house you will receive the keys to the new house okay okay all righty ladies and gentlemen okay all right whoever 
be aware of someone who is a waterman uh, someone who is an an, an uh, I'll, um, whoever this person is so beware because she stole something the person who stole or is going to steal something out of your house is an Aquarius, a Gemini, a Gemini, or a Libra. The person who stole something out of your house is an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Be aware of whoever this woman is. She is the one who has stole something out of your house. If you have lost a ring, if you have lost a ring, if you find out that your jewelry has been stolen, the person who has stolen this is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra. She is the one who came and took your ring out of your house. And it could be someone who is connected, someone who came in your house who was not supposed to be there, someone who has gotten help to come in your house um, because she had the keys for your house and this is someone who must have been living in that house before or someone that someone else gave her the key to come in your house whoever you are if you're living in an apartment complex be aware of that people are getting in your apartment and whoever is going to go and steal something out of your apartment is someone who is an Aquarius Gemini or a Libra this person also um, work uh, um, black magic and she deals with black magic okay um, this person is a sick person she is basically in unbalance or um, a light um, she doesn't have any positive light she's from the dark and that is a person stand up to this person and now I know why the seven of ones comes out because it's saying stand up to this person and protect yourself because this is the person that stole from you and the person is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra it is an air sign person it can and um, um, you know the energy of this darkness and the sword this is the person because it first came up you have a strong foundation against this person and this person works negative energy stand up against this person and show them that you're not afraid and she better bring back that ring because it's not hers she's just a thief a liar and a sick person and she works in the dark so there you go ladies and gentlemen I so dislike people like that I so dislike people who just basically wants to jump over other people and they lie and they cheat and they deceive whoever this person is someone at your apartment complex or someone um, wherever you are gave her your key and that's how she came in and took your thing and she better bring it back okay so you get on your knees and you pray to God and you ask her to bring back your ring or bring back whatever it is that she has stolen she has stolen different things out of the apartment she is a thief she has tried to got away with something and when she didn't get away with it she had to pay back some money and that's why she came and took your stuff she is a thief she's supposed to go to jail let her bring back your stuff and let her um, be caught up the outcomes it was a karmatic situation this is a situation that someone you did not do something like this to someone else this person is a sick person she worked with the darkness it's a sick person she needs to get the hell out of there and bring back your stuff the Sun comes out so yes <laughs> the Sun comes out so yes <laughs> okay so ladies and gentlemen um, I guess doing this reading in my room gave me more positive energy it's beginning to rain outside but not to worry anyway ladies and gentlemen gotta go namaste until next week